Hello again, YouTube. Back for another round of gaming here with a different game than I've played before. Um, I have no idea what to expect. But it is called Kane. So let's get into it. I gotta tell you, it's beautiful already. But then again, this is just the FMV at the beginning, so who knows? We'll have to see. I'm not even sure what kind of game this is. <sighs> and I don't know what genre it is, I mean. Like, I don't know if it's horror, I don't know if it's sci-fi, I don't know if it's... I mean, it's apparently not fantasy, but I don't know. I don't know what to expect in this game. Is that me? I'm pretty. Am I am, am I crying? I don't want a child. I've never wanted one. I, I had a plan and this wasn't part of it. Relax. I promise this won't hurt a bit. How would he know? <laughs> Thanks. Just a few more items to check off and we can start. What Name and ID? Hadley, 140 9 And the procedure is being paid for by a third party? Yes. They no explanation needed. No family listed? No family. It's just me. A special order here. Ah, that's for me. Right then. Let's begin. Nurse. Now, count back from ten. <sighs> ten. Eight, so we start off with an abortion. Nine. That's You'll be a cheery start to a video Sweetie. game. Eight. Seven. Insert snoring noises here. Oh, this looks so fun. This looks so cheery. I'm so glad. I'm so glad I'm getting into this game. <laughs> oh, gosh, what I got myself into. Alright. What do you got for me, game? Oh, that's not fun. Why? Why is this some random mech suit thing moving? What's going on? Oh God! Where am I? That's what I want to know. What did you do to me? <laughs> okay, so I'm getting poor. Okay. Oh God! Please. Please. Guys, is this a special? Is this a special note? Oh God. Oh, okay. I'm Please help me. Please let me go. I can't do anything. I'm just kind of watching this, I guess. I'm with you guys. I have no idea what's going on or what the, what the, what the heck. It's even this. <laughs> um, is there something that I'm supposed to be doing right now? Beginning fetal extraction pre-check. What are you doing? Answer me! God damn it! Fucking answer me! Well, apparently this one's. I'm gonna have to um, 
Yeah. What are you gonna do to me? But I can see stuff. Okay. Oh, that's fun. Blood, blood, amniotic fluids. Uh. And I'm just laying in this. Post welfare is irrelevant. The whole thing. Post welfare is not irrelevant. I have you know. I have no idea what I'm doing, guys. Present. Fetal extraction cancelled. Jesus. I'm still pregnant. Bad to think if this is a bad dream. Fetal extraction? <laughs> this is all because of the baby? Pregnant. I am pregnant. This isn't right. Okay, then. Please remain calm. After the removal of your wing, you will join Scan complete. Subject no longer present. Fetal extraction okay. cancelled. Oh, that's nice. That's, that's, that's nice. Please remain calm. After the removal of your wing, you will drift back to sleep. Your self from the skip size will be remembered for generation. Software updated 0001.9.01. This is batshit crazy. This is crazy. I am crazy. Recalibration in process. Successful removal of fetus without endometrial tearing. Successful removal of uterus without endometrial tearing. Software updated. Failed to extract uterus. Failed to extract uterus. Extraction progress. The Adams calibration. Joseph Bueno, level 5, software update version 3.13, error. Danny Boland, level 2, power relay integration, Hank, level 1, service, Hank, level 1, extraction. Service brain, level 5, software update. I have no idea what any of this means. You will drift back to sleep. Your cell from the skip to sides will be remembered for generations to come. Please remain calm. Error, no valid target selected. Okay, then. Sorry, guys. I'm just trying to figure out what I need to do next. I only do so much. Is there a door or something? Okay. 
your selfless gift to science will be remembered for generations to come. Please remain calm. Hmm. Please remain calm. You might prefer to think of this as a bad dream. You must be awake during the extraction procedure. Please remain calm. After the removal of your wound, you will drift back to sleep. Your selfless gift to science will be remembered for generations to come. You must be awake during the extraction procedure. Please remain calm. After the removal of the um, you will drift back to sleep. I'm Your kind of at a loss here, guys. Will be remembered for generations to come. Not real sure what I need to do. Please remain calm. You might prefer to think of this as a bad dream. You must be awake during the extraction procedure. Please remain calm. I'm gonna pause here for a second. Let's see if I can figure out what I need to do next. Okay, so I found a guide. I don't know what to do here. You must be awake during the extraction procedure. Scan complete. Subject no longer present. Fetal extraction cancelled. Okay, let's try this again. Scan complete. How am I supposed to get on Subject that? Subject no longer present. Fetal extraction cancelled. Let's try this again. Scan complete. Subject no longer heck? present. Fetal extraction cancelled. Please remain calm. After the removal of your wound, you will drift back to sleep. Your selfless signs will be remembered for generations to come. Please remain calm. Error. No valid target selected. You might prefer to think of this as a bad dream. You must be. There's no way for me to get on the bed though. Oh, I'm just an idiot, that's all. Scan it worked! Subject in place. Feet is ready for extraction. There we go. Begin womb extraction process. <sighs> breathe, Hadley. Breathe. Oh god. God. You've got to be kidding me. Apparently the facility had a bit of indigestion there. Jeebus. Heck, I gotta get out of here. Oh, now you want to watch your language, okay. <laughs> and apparently I died. Nice. <laughs> or not, okay. And to think a fall could have been a good thing for me a few months ago. <laughs> nice. Oh, uncalled for, Hadley. Funny, but uncalled for. What's a glint? I like glints. Oh, that's fun. Okay. Um. Hey. 
can't reach. Oh, that's not fun. That doesn't need to be a thing. Oh, God. Like shrine. Maybe stabbing that oaf wasn't such a bad thing. Okay. It's so dark. What? Hello? Who's there? It's dark in here. I can't see anything. I, I can't see you. Who are you? Why? Why can't I see? What's happened to my eyes? Where are... God. What is that feeling? My hands. Oh. My feet. My fucking skin. I found some spares. What? Nothing. Bad joke. Where am I? Okay, okay. Keep calm. Was I... Was I in an accident? I don't know. I, th I think I can smell blood. Well, uh... I'm Hadley. I, I can't. Can't remember my name. Can't remember. It'll come back to you. I'm sure it'll come back to you. Hello? You there? Um, it's dark, but I can hear muffled noises. I can hear, I can hear my tongue. <laughs> Speak up, buddy! Was that a go 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 ghost? Well, as long as I can I be with a so. kiddo inside me. Okay, then. Um, can I get an Omni tool? Access denied. I guess that. <laughs> okay. Breathe, Hadley. This must be a side effect. You're still asleep. No, I wasn't trying to click that. Come on. Over here. <laughs> All right then. <laughs> hot, 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 hot. <laughs> really? You think? Oh, that's nice. Ew, hey, I am gross. not. I am not sick. I mean, I might be, but I'm not. But I'm not that. But not this kind of sick. I'm not. I'm clumps of hair are not falling out of my head. <clears throat> and I'll go ahead and read. I guess <laughs> Alice is sick. Clumps of her hair were falling out while I brushed it before her bedtime story last night. And this morning, she was listless and pale and leaky. Mother says the food in the facility is bad, and just to be safe, I started feeding her protein powder from my own stash, but I think it's something in her IV lines. We pumped a lot of unregulated experimental chemicals through the, through the host, and maybe their blood has become contaminated. I need to find a new source. Perhaps a sample from the brood. The brood? What the heck? My sister's health trumps getting busted snooping around... Kern's menagerie again, and I need to resupply supply the brood gas canisters anyway. Besides, it's an opportunity for scientific research. Like Dr. Adams would quip. You know what I'm- you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Oh. You know what I'm saying? I get it. I get it. I don't get it. But I laugh anyway. Mother says I need to laugh at jokes if people will think I'm creepy. 
I decided to make a list of behavioral prompts and appropriate responses because of the social stuff getting complicated. Behavioral prompts and appropriate responses. Laugh if any somebody makes a joke. Blame Joseph if somebody else complains that the uh, that body parts are going missing from the bio waste disposal units, or blame one of the cane techs instead. Three question mark. Lucy's responding to the new treatment. Lucy is Alice. Was Alice? I think the name suits her better since she got her new face last week. She looks more like Lucy now. We had an intern once named Lucy. She had the same freckles on her nose. That was before, though. The other me, when I was much older, is it's confusing. I asked Dr. Adams about that, and he explained because of the accident, my memories are not always reliable. So it's possible I dreamed up that part about her subsequent vivisection. But the screams and the tears, and the way her organs gleamed in the surgical light seemed so real. And more than a bit erotic, I'll admit. Erotic? What the? Oh my god. One interesting, if somewhat unexpected, consequence of the new blood transfusion source is that Lucy now excretes a mucosal substance not entirely similar in effect to the brood gas. Oral indigestion certainly produces a comparable analgesic, analgesic response. I started scraping it off her skin and sort, storing it in the specimen jars because mother says licking my own sister is improper. 3. Don't lick your sister. Whatever, but now I can carry it around with me and use it when the pain becomes too much, so it's also a more practical. Listen. What in the hell is going on in this world? Good lord. Work has been very busy. Two batches of hosts have been. have had to be terminated because. have had to be terminated ahead of schedule due to a series of malfunctions with Mother's Product Viability Evaluation Ship. There's been a lot of engineers and cleaners in and out of the lab, so I've. Moved Lucy from the storage closet to the atmospheric control room for now. My reputation around the facility is problematic enough already, and I don't need somebody finding her and making things even worse. Mother says they wouldn't understand. There's also much more space in the atmospheric control room. As so soon as I've resolved the issues with her left leg, I think I'll teach Lucy how to do the walls. I've been reading about maggot therapy for treating necrosis and a sample of Kern's uh, larva recently turned up in the lab. Time for some more scientific research. The arm chip failures have been have made Dr. Adams even more anxious than usual, and today I heard him asking Joseph about irregularities in lab security access log. I've seen Joseph looking around in the lab with a woman late at night sometimes, but he told Dr. Adams he doesn't know anything about it. Dr. Adams believes believed him because he believes everything Joseph tells him. Or maybe Dr. Adams just doesn't want some just doesn't want Joseph to get into trouble for some reason. The way he so obviously ignores Joseph's uh, extracurricular activities with the host, for example. He's really protective of the man. July 13th. I had to amputate Lucy's left leg last night. Although the maggot therapy showed some superficial improvement initially, the necrotic progression was apparently already too advanced, and parts of the limb had started to liquefy. What a mess. We got a new batch of hosts fresh from Keenan family planning to prep for second stage product incubation this week, so I should be able to find a suitable placement donor. The problems with Mother have persisted on and off, however, and she says the engineers want to wipe and reinstall her operating system. I can't allow this to happen. What if Mother doesn't love me anymore? What if she forgets me? Yeah, I was thinking Mother was like a computer, given some of the other things that have been said, so yeah, that just kind of confirms that. Hadley is sick again. Oh, Hadley. Oh, Hadley is Lucy. Used to be Lucy. I decided to call her Hadley now because I saw the name on a host file and I think it's really pretty. The host is really pretty too. So is her leg. So is her left leg. Oh, God. Anyway, I suspect that Hadley's new illness is related to the fungus that's contaminated the air vents all over the facility, which means a total lockdown at this level. Her mouth and nostrils are clogged with slime with a slimy substance, and a lung biopsy revealed a startling but, but impressive range of mycotoxin of unknown taxonomy. Several of her teeth had, have fallen out, and her mucosal excre excretions smell like ammonia. Uh? Between this and the recent incidents with Mother, I've been thinking that an escape plan. But an escape plan. Getting Hadley and Mother to the elevator will be difficult, though, and even if I could, my lack of PDT won't allow escape. What the hell? 
So I'm like a clone? Apparently I'm like a clone of the girl from the original thing. Okay. Um, <laughs> okay. Okay, then. Oh, I see them now. I didn't see them before. Oh, here we go. Uh, okay, that's looks like it's more of the same that I've already seen here. Plus flag left. Plus flag right, right. It seems like a code of some sort. Uh. Server calibration in progress. It worked. <laughs> What word exactly? Empty void? What? That's not fun. I'm gonna find out what's going on. Why not? What the heck was that sound? That sounds so fun. I'm glad I'm not in there with that. What's this? Okay. Just go down somewhere. But where?
Oh, that's fun. Can I at least like do the dignity of freaking cutting them down at least? No? Okay. That's not fun. Um I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Somebody there. F fuck it out. I said there's somebody there. I can't see shit through this bleeding plasma shield. Uh, hello? What the fuck? How you get in here, eh? I came in from the service shaft. Get down the fucking service shaft, eh? You think I'm fake? You're taking the piss? You a spy or something? What? Of course not. This slag thinks I believe her. I'm just gonna get down to this pipe, eh? Well, listen here, bitch. Just come a little closer, and I'll teach you what a service pipe is. Uh huh. Charming. <laughs> okay. Well, um. The game crashed, so I'm going to call it here. That's about all the time I had for today anyway. So, I hope you enjoyed this. I know I found it certainly interesting. Um, definitely going to continue playing this. But for now, peace, love, and keep being awesome.